Hello guys, here is a new ceiling fan I just got today. This is a Heritage Alexis, or I don't know how you pronounce that word, 42 inch ceiling fan. I got this ceiling fan from the Habitat store for $15. Here's the $15 symbol right here. And I got it because it was the cheapest fan there and I thought this was going to be in too good of condition to be from the 1990s, but yet yeah, this ceiling fan is from September of 1993. So this is approaching uh, 30 years old already. And this is probably, it's probably as cheap as you can get fan back in the day. It was, the metal feels a bit cheap on this fan and the blades feel a bit cheap, but the motor was a decent weight to it, so... It's got some quality to it, and I'll show you guys the tag of it. So, yeah, the ceiling fan is missing its globe, and I have a lot of other globes on hand. I may get a new one, or I may just use what I have on hand. I'll look through my globe bin and see if there is any that would fit on this size uh, switch. So, yeah. And also, if you think... $15 was ridiculous for a teenage budget. Um, you better think again because I saw a 30 inch hugger fan for $35. There's a Hampton Bay ceiling fan from 2007 for 45. There was a, a Harbor Breeze ceiling fan that was 42 inch. It was kind of like this one for $40. And there was a Hunter ceiling fan for 50. So, yeah, this one was the cheapest out of the bunch and the oldest out of the bunch, too, because I looked at all the dates on all of them. So, yeah, this one right here was a substantial better value, and I didn't find too many good th other good things. No two-prong outlets, no vintage switches, no vintage wall plate. So, this was the only good one I found, and it's in good condition. How are the bl the metals in good condition? How are the bl how are the blades are a bit scratched, but actually not too bad. But I I thought this was in like I said earlier, I thought this was in too good of condition to be from '93. So yeah, I'll show you guys the fan. Here's the light. I'm using a 300 watt incandescent bulb. Here is the fan. I'm going to start with low. It has a nice aesthetic low to it. It has a nice gentle breeze like you would. It has a nice slow low to it, which is good. If you need a steady small breeze, this is a good breeze for it. And for testing purposes, I have it on a two switch circuit. So the top light, the top switch is for the light and the bottom one is for the fan. Here's medium. And the bearings are pretty bad in it. So I'm gonna replace them. It has a nice wine, motor wine to it. I like that. Even though this is a cheap as you can get fan back in the 1990s, I still like these. I've been looking for the same model for a long time and I'm happy to have one. Now, hi. And this is so showing off as the walnut side. There's a medium oak for the other. This thing puts out some nice air for a 42 inch fan. And now off. I mean, it's, it still has a good spin down time, but the bearings are worn out. So yeah, here's the other side. And here's the walnut side. If I were to use it, I'd use this side just because I would think that side looks better. But that's just my opinion. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the video of this ceiling fan. Thank you. Have a nice day.